AIRS stands for Adding Insulation When Residing. Let's take a look at some of the main advantages of this energy upgrade. Old walls usually have holes, cracks, and gaps running the length of the walls. A lot of new houses have these too. These gaps cause drafts and they suck heat into and out of walls. Regular insulation doesn't stop airflow, but it does do a pretty good job of slowing heat between the framing. Unfortunately, a lot of heat leaks through the studs, floor joists, and floor framing. Continuous exterior insulation covers all of the framing, greatly reducing heat flow through the walls and floor. Carefully taping and detailing the rigid insulation layer also slows airflow through the walls, significantly reducing drafts and shedding any water that gets behind the siding. Thermal conduction and air leaks are two of the biggest energy wasters in homes. Adding insulation when residing is a once in a generation opportunity to increase comfort, improve energy efficiency, and cut sound transmission from the outside. All of that at only incremental additional cost to the residing project you've already planned and budgeted for. The AIRS research, rationale, and resulting installation guidelines were developed by the Pacific Northwest National Laboratory with funding from the U.S. Department of Energy. You can find more AIRS guidance at the Building America Solution Center or the AIRS website.